Hello once again everybody, Butch Bella here. Welcome to another edition of our Sales Power Tips video blog. Thanks so much for joining us and I'm going to do something a little bit different uh, from here on out. We're going to try to keep these to four to five minutes long, somewhere in there. I know uh, sometimes I get a little bit long-winded and can take a little more time than, than we need to. I want to try to keep this information condensed, something that you can obviously uh, get some benefit out of, but also something that you can watch and uh, maybe as you start your morning or as you have a few moments during the day, but certainly something that does not take uh, a whole long time. So uh, we're going to try to keep them to four or five minutes. So with that being said, I need to get going with today's Sales Power Tips video blog. Today we're going to talk about avoiding burnout, how to avoid burnout. And I'm going to give you three tips that I have found over the years are tremendous helps to me because we all go through burnout. We've all been through that, man, I am just fried syndrome. Mentally, physically, emotionally, we're drained. Here's some tips that I hope you can take with you. And if you've got something to write with, you might want to write them down. If not, you can pause, rewind, that's why we do the video blogs. The first one is if you make new business calls, if you're out making calls uh, for new presentations and you're doing new presentations and so forth, three, maybe four of those a day is about the max that you can do. And, and not from a physical standpoint, but from an emotional standpoint. You have to be so on emotionally. You have to be... Uh, have your energy level so high, you have to ha have your senses so tuned in to listen, to communicate, that three or four of those is, is probably pretty much all you can squeeze into a day. Now, you may have time to do eight or nine, but I'm telling you, if you try to do that, burnout is going to be just around the corner because emotionally, you're going to crash. The second thing that I, will, that I will tell you is to find something creative as an outlet. Find something that you can do as a hobby that's creative. Now, golf is great. Tennis is great. Running is great. But those all require more physical exertion. Uh, find something that, that you can do creatively to take your mind away from work, um, whether that's reading I love to write, obviously, so I, I write. You know, one of the greatest ones I've ever found? Doing puzzles. If you are, and I know it sounds crazy, but if you enjoy the creative part of doing puzzles, something to get your, get your brain just totally, uh, you cannot do a, a, one of these real tough puzzles and think about anything else. So I would suggest you do something like that. Finally, Take some time, sometime, whether it's a weekend, whether it's a long weekend, unplug completely. Get away. No cell phone, no internet, no email. You could put a voicemail and an email alert on that tells everybody, I'm going to be out of touch. Let your manager know uh, who your customer should contact if there is an issue. Do not feel guilty about unplugging. Here is the, here is the big catch-22 for a great salesperson. You feel guilty when you're working that you ought to be with your family because you're working 60 hours a week. Then you feel guilty with your family because I ought to be working because I really owe it to my career. Do not be afraid to unplug. Okay, Put the phone down. Put your iPad down. Unplug. Get away from the Internet. Do those things that you have to do. So once again, limit your new business calls. Uh, don't be afraid to unplug and then find yourself a creative outlet to, uh, to do things that take your mind off of work. Those are three tips that I hope that you will embrace that will, will help you avoid burnout. That's going to wrap up this week's Sales Power Tips video blog. And by looking at my clock, i got about 40 seconds left to get some plugs in. And we've got some plugs. I want to remind you to stop by our website at butchbella.com. B-U-T-C-H-B-E-L-L-A-H.com. Also, I'm very, very proud, a long time in the works, our Udemy course is available www.udemy.com search for the power of 10 10 essential habits for sales superstars it is a 10 module course at Udemy and it is literally 90 solid minutes of recorded audio along with some video if you were to go straight through an hour and a half 
working on your own, this is at least a three-hour uh, course. It's $177. You will not be sorry. Uh, the first 10 people over this week, depending on when you're watching it, are going to save 100 bucks off their use promo code SPT for Sales Power Tips. Also, follow us on Twitter, at Sales Power Tips. And don't forget to like our Facebook page, Butch Bella Coaching. That's going to do it for this week. I'll see you next week. Mm-hmm.